this is the review, and I'm James, and I've got to go. Bye. Um, yes, that was James. Just so James could be in this video, um, we did that. He but was supposed to actually be in. He was supposed to be in the video, but he just had to go. Um, but anyway, this is a review of Saint Tro 2 on the Xbox 360. And, um, we're going to, you know, tell you a little information about the game and give you a rating on what we think and maybe what could be improved about this game. It's, um, it's available on PS3, 360, and PC. And PC. Um, it's a, it's a fun game, you can, ev like, well, not everyone can enjoy it. <laughs> Obviously little kids will not enjoy it very much, but, um, it's, it's, um, a really good game. There's a lot of awesome weapons, like the pimp slaps, like you just hit the trigger, um, and the fire button, and watch the person you hit fly. Mm. The game features a quite long and interesting storyline which I found very interesting but the game also has lots of repo replay value because it has side missions and you know little fun things to do and there are plenty of easter eggs and inside jokes for you to enjoy in the game the I would recommend either getting the Xbox 360 or PS3 version as the PC version seems unoptimized and can run a little slowly even on high-end computers However, the graphics are great, and, you know, the the gameplay is brilliant. The controls are simple and easy to use. For example, you hold B and use the analog stick to use a weapon. It's a very, very quick and effective way. The game also features, you know, very good multiplayer. It includes a f complete co-op um, system, so you can do all your campaign missions online with a friend or just any random person. It also has a slayer type online mode where you can just, you know, do whatever. Kill people. Anything, really. I just got run down by a taxi. Yeah, and you can do things like get run down by a taxi. However, this game does have some downfalls. For example, a lot of the great features from the original Saints Row are not present in Saints Row 2. For example, the wheel woman who would drive you to wherever you want to go and the mobile mp3 player lets you play your own songs. Also the train is missing, but we really don't think that's a big deal. Um, there's also a lot of cool cheats in this game, so that can increase your experience of the, of the fun. Um, I don't know what this one is, but I've heard it before, Jake, what does it do? It makes people you kill, um, fly up into the sky. Okay, then I won't bother with that one. Um, there's cheats for the abilities, um, vehicle, different vehicles, different weapons, the weather, and um, world effects like in here it's got we've got gravity and drunk people, so people will always be drunk, so they'll walk around basically staggering all over the place. We're going to have to end this review pretty soon because I've just noticed the battery level on my camera. But we've decided to give this game an 88.5 out of 100. We think the, gra the gameplay, the graphics and the storyline are brilliant, but some things just let it down. However, we would recommend this over Grand Theft Auto 4, due to it's just basically more fun and crazy. Thanks for watching this OJ review, and, you know, rate, comment and subscribe to keep updated with our latest videos. Thank you for watching, and P.S. to all our friends. I hope this one's a little better. Thanks for watching.